WND reported when the side of trucks bearing the United Nations logo being carted on Virginia's highways had some internet bloggers asking why, but as one interested reader posted in the comment section of a story about the curious observance, these trucks are made in America and need to be transported for shipment to you. S. Seaports. But first, the story. In a piece entitled, UN Military Vehicle Seen Rolling Down Virginia Interstate, American Mirror writer Olaf Ekberg asked, what were United Nations vehicles doing in Virginia? Horizontal ellipsis. That's what motorists were left to wonder when they saw UN tactical vehicles, with bulletproof glass, on a flatbed truck and rolling down Interstate 81. A Facebook user named Jeff Stern posted several photographs of the scene, alongside a brief statement that read, Can't begin to tell you how many of these I passed today on 81 near Lexington, VA. Interesting times ahead. And from there, Readers of Stern's post expressed concern as well. Tactical vehicles, with bulletproof glass? Whatever could those be for, and why are you in vehicles here, in this country? Wrote Fernando Johnson, the American Mirror reported. As one alert reader to the American Mirror report noted in the comments section beneath the story, the U. N. Trucks are actually built in U. S. They're built at the Buy Systems plant in York, PA. A poster named Bobby Elrod said. From there they are carried down to I-91 to I-77, and then I-95 towards the port of Savannah to be shipped overseas. As the Daily Mail noted, Bobby Wayne Ginn said in a Facebook post that he's seen the trucks in Texas and that he was wondering why 30 United Nations vehicles, fully loaded with combat-prepared troops, were driving down our highway in Dallas, Texas. Following his post, the website Liberty asked, in a post that was undated but contained several pictures of you. N. Vehicles being driven rather than transported, are these you? N. Troops here preparing for air economic collapse in America? Is this related to Iran ships approaching the U. S. Border? But a good portion of the information dealing with you. N. Presence in the United States is unsubstantiated. Some readers, for instance, say the U. N has been using America's military bases for training grounds for years, others say the photos and stories of you. N. Sightings in the United States aren't always dated or confirmed, and should therefore be relegated to conspiracy status. If you like this video please leave a like and subscribe.